Loneliness surrounds me Without your arms around me And the sun will never shine In apartment number nine Apartment number nine, this is the George Jones version You might remember it by Tammy Wynette uh, I think she originally was the one that had it out. But anyway, Johnny Paycheck wrote it, and he had a cut on it as well. I think a lot of people uh, recorded this song. But anyway, I had a request by Braden, 1911. Uh, usually here on YouTube to uh, do a version of this, or George's version anyway, a lesson on this. So uh, we're going to jump right into this thing. And I've got a cover on this song as well. I always do, so you can follow along, play along with it if you'd like to. I'll put a link to that lesson, or that cover, down in the description below. And so anyway, we're going to jump right into a three-chord country song. Can't beat that. My favorite key, D, and one of my other favorite chords, G, in there. So anyway, let's jump right into it. If you could give us a thumbs up on it, subscribe to us. And we're going to get right in it. Here we go. All right, we got a D right here. And we got a G. You can get that G however you want to. Some people get it like that. I jump around sometimes and get it. So if you see me play it different ways, hey, just uh, get it whichever way you want to and stick with it. And then I got an A chord in there. Uh, and you can do a, you know, one finger or two or three or however you want to there. So just a three chord country song. Got a little bit of a lick in there. I might uh, kind of, I don't know, I, I kind of improvised and, and uh, kind of made up a little break in there. When we get to it, I'll, uh, I'll show you. Well, I, I probably won't show you what I did because it's going to be different, but uh, I'll kind of give you an idea. You can just kind of play around the chords and get that get that break in there. It doesn't really matter too much uh, that you stick with, you know, exactly what they did because I'll be honest with you, the other versions are probably a little bit different. But anyway, just uh, you can strum the chord if you want to to get started or if you kind of got the uh, note in your head there to start out because there's just, you know, he just starts out singing is the way George does it. I'm not sure on Tammy's. It's been a while since I've heard hers. But anyway, so we're just going to, I got a, got, got it in my head there. So I'm going to just start with uh, uh, just the first verse here and um, jump right into it. Here we go. Just follow the stairway hey, to this lonely world of mine. That's the first verse. Now, guess what? The rest of the song is exactly the same way. So that's really cool. And uh, it really helps us out, us musicians out when they write them like that. There's, there's nothing different. The chorus, uh, everything is the same. Same progression. So it's just, uh, <clears throat> and what I'm doing on the strumming and the, on the D, I'm just uh, alternating the uh, fourth string, plugging that down, and then the third string down, up. Okay. So four string down, up. And we're going to G doing the sixth string and the fourth string. So just sixth string down up, fourth string down up, and then the A it's just fifth string down up, fourth string down up. And so that's the the progression is just D, G, A, so just the one, four, five chords there. And then when it goes back to the D, then we go to G. And then we stop. Now he stops, you can let it ring out if you want to. Sometimes I pray for you, but it, he kind of, he stops. Uh, not so very long ago You walked away from me I may be phrasing it different than he does, but that's okay. You phrase it however you want to. You know, just kind of, as long as you stick with the melody pretty close, it's okay. And after all the plans we made You decided to be free. Here's our tea again. Okay, so that's just, that's the same. It's all the way through there. D, G, A, D, and then jumps to that G again, and then back to the D, okay? And then the, I guess the chorus says, the uh, loneliness surrounds me. And we go through that. Again, it's the same uh, progression there. And uh, I may do, I'll show you the ending of that. So uh, I won't do it here uh, just to sh keep the, the video uh, a little shorter. Uh, but anyway, he jumps into that part, and then after this, the loneliness surrounds me part, uh, he does a little uh, lead part. Now, I kind of, I'm not going to break it down. I, 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 I say that, and I try, and I try to break it down. I'm not going to try to do that because, uh, uh, as I say, it's just it's going to be different every time for me. So, but what I did is I played the, uh, uh, I played the F chord. 
a position uh, in, for G, and um, I don't know if I don't think I did it in A. I just did it in G and went back to A here. But you don't have to do that. You can go to the open chord and just play around it. But I'll kind of give you some kind of tips on that, how you could do it, and uh, just play it around, like I say, within the chord. So anyway, um, I'm just on the fourth and third and second string. So I just went. So I fourth, third, and second. And, I'm, and there I'm just second and third. And I just slid down on that third string. Again, just a hammer on on the on the fourth and third. And then this is the fourth string that I'm doing this. All four string, just uh, second, fourth, and, and fifth. And back to the fourth and second. And G. And I forgot I think I forgot to do the G when I did the uh, uh, when I did the cover, actually, but uh, uh, so I just stayed in the D there. But uh, and you could, like, I say if you don't want to do this G, you know, you just Again, just playing around, playing around those chords, uh, and, and you can kind of getting that melody, picking that melody out. Uh, really, just staying uh, second and fourth uh, frets right there, uh, and get most of it there. Uh, you might you might hit the third fret on some of that stuff, but uh, mostly second and fourth, and, and you can get everything you need and, and pick out those notes for the melody, and just play around with it, have fun with it, create you know your own thing that you want to do there. And if you just want to go through the chords, if you're not comfortable with picking right now, and you just want to. This last uh, the last chorus here. Well, actually, let me let me take it back. Once he comes out of that uh, that lead part, there's another verse. Okay, I keep waiting in this lonely room, uh, and then he goes to the chorus again. Loneliness surrounds me. So I'm just going to do the loneliness. Loneliness surrounds me. He repeats that last line. I'll show you what he does there. Because instead of ending it uh, like normally going to the D uh, at the end of that apartment number nine, he goes to G. Okay, which a lot of times a lot of songs do, especially on the country songs you'll hear. Uh, and they'll go instead of going to the uh, the one chord, they'll go to the four chord. Okay, so uh, uh, they're going to the it goes to the G there instead of the D. So here's the uh, the chorus the last time, and we'll end it out here. Okay, here it goes. Loneliness surrounds me. Without your arms around me, and the sun will never shine. I did a little hammer on on my middle finger, just raised that middle finger up, and uh, did a hammer on on that first string, second fret there. So it's just, no, the sun will never shine. Hey, in a part number G, and not a D. Something like that right there, apartment number nine. George Jones, Braden, appreciate the request on that. Hope hope we did that justice for you. <laughs> hope you still like the song. And uh, I think your granddad, you said your granddad used to uh, play that song and sing it. So uh, uh, anyway, uh, awesome song. And uh, I know there's some great memories there. So uh, 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 like I say, hopefully, uh, like I say, I didn't... Uh, 
taint those memories any <laughs> of my version of it. But uh, anyway, uh, uh, if you got any uh, questions or comments, uh, please leave them down below and request as well. And we'd love to hear from you. Uh, only good, good comments only. That's all we want to hear from is just good ones. But uh, if you leave a bad one, I'll probably comment back anyway. It's okay. But we anyway, appreciate everything. Appreciate y'all watching. Could get a thumbs up on this. Subscribe to us if you would. Um, check out our other uh, videos out on Fretmore and the links down below. I have a link, like I say, to that cover. And you can follow along with and check out our other videos. We'll see y'all next one. Thanks.